Hey, welcome to Graphic Policy Television, GPTV. I'm Brett. It's Wednesday, which means it's a brand new comic book day. New comics are hitting the shelves all across the world. You can go get them digitally, digitally. you can get them physically. It's like the best day of the week because you can get comics any way you want. DC's got a special, $9.99. It's DC's Beach Blanket Bad Guys Summer Special. Having some fun with a little beach blanket bingo. A whole bunch of stories, 10 short stories from all of, uh, just a massive amount of creators. Uh, we're going to read them off because it's kind of it's an impressive group. Uh, we got World's Finest, a Joker Bizarro story by Lee Bermejo, Francesco Mattina as art, and uh, Tom Napolitano as lettering. Gigantus Strong, a Gigantus story, and Michael Morecci is the water uh, writer. Max Rayner is the artist, Paul Mounts colors, Dave Sharp letter. Help, a Lex Luthor story, Jeff Loveness is a writer, David Williams artist, Steve Bacciolato is colors, Carlos Manigual is letters. Cruel Summers, Gorilla Garad, Tim Seeley is a writer, Minkyu Jung is the artist, John Callas letters. Uh, Carlers, Tom Napolitano's letter, Close Shave, Mr. Free Story, Paul Dini is the writer, John Paul Leon is the artist, Darren Bennett is the letterer, Dog Days of Summer, Deathstroke Story, Shea Fontana is the writer, Carlos uh, Diranda is the artist, Luis Guerrero is color, uh, Carlos Manguel is the letterer, False Idols is a cheetah story, Vito Ayala is the writer, uh, Amake Nahuelpin is the artist, Jun Chung is the co letter, or color, Clayton Coles is the letter, Perfect Gentleman is a Penguin Story, Daniel Kibblesmith is the writer, Laura Braga is the artist, Arif Prianto's Colors, Dave Sharp Letter, Icy and Bryce is a Black Manta Story, Gabriel Hardman and Karina Bechko is the writers, Gabriel Hardman is art, Matthew Wilson Colors, Darren Bennett is the letter, and Independence is a Crime Syndicate Story, is Colin Kelly and Jackson Lansing is the writers, Giuseppe Kamakoli is the pencil, Cam Smith Inc., Tamu Mori is the colors, Clayton Coles is the letters, it's a lot of talent there. Some we've seen on DC Comics. Some I think are brand new to comics. I kind of like these anthologies and specials like that and that you get a, a sense of maybe some creators who we've never seen before taking on some DC characters. It's a great way to try out new talent and see how they do. Uh, and most of this is entertaining. It's good. Um, I don't know if it's necessarily worth $9.99. If it was like $5.99, I would say absolutely go get it. If it was $6.99, I would probably say get, uh, go get it. $8.99, $9.99 is where I'm starting kind of going that eh department. None of it's bad. It's all quick reads, 10 pages. Some of them are absolutely fantastic. Mr. Freeze's story really stands out to me. Uh, it's kind of fun, entertaining. It's all Paul Dini, so what a shock on that. Uh, and some of them kind of fall a little bit flat, not necessarily because they're bad stories, but interestingly enough, it's because there's some weird cuts and editing to them. They don't feel like the story is complete in some ways. Um, the Joker uh, Bizarro one is one that's like that, that stands out to me. Um, it just kind of gets to this, uh, it just kind of gets to this ending of it, and you're like, what, you know, what's kind of the build-up to this? Um, the other is that not all of these feel, you know, not all of these have, like, have to do with the beach. Um, they're all kind of warm-ish vibes to it. Uh, some of them are more beach than others. Uh, so kind of like the theme doesn't quite nail, uh, get nailed for every single one. So yeah, like this is basically one if, you know, you got some money to spend and you want to try out uh, a comic to see a whole bunch of different creators, cool, go for it. Um, yeah, I mean, that's it's, it's not bad. There's some actually really cool stuff in it. Uh, you know, it's not one that I'm like enthusiastically jumping up and down about. And, uh, you know, some of the, the art varies greatly. Like, there is some fantastic art. Like, that art, uh, Lee Bermejo, I think, is the artist on that one. Uh, no, there was someone else that was doing that. It wasn't his. It was, uh, yeah, it was Francesco Mattina is the artist on that one. Uh, you know, is, is top notch. And then there's some that doesn't quite fit. Um, and, you know, to show how varying they can be, you know, there's the Lex Luthor story. Obviously very different than what we just saw. And, um... Yeah, I mean, basically, it's, it's an anthology. Like, some's good, some's bad. Uh, some work really well. Some kind of have a weird edit to them that I, I made me kind of scratch my head a little bit. And some is absolutely fantastic. That I would love to see some of these creators take on some of these characters even more. Uh, there's some great concepts in there. So, basically, like, if you, if you got money to spend, go for it. Nine ninety nine. It's a little bit hard to recommend just because it's it's expensive. Ten bucks is expensive. Um, there are, as I said, there are ten stories in there, and yeah. Um, so yeah. So basically, if you're a diehard DC fan, you want to check out all these creators, 
doing some different things, go for it. Uh, it's not one I'm gonna I'm gonna outright recommend. Just the price throw me off a little bit. Again, if it was six ninety nine, I would have no problem with it at all. I think six ninety nine is very reasonable uh, for this amount of stories. Def of creators nine ninety nine is where I kind of start getting a little iffy. Um, yeah, so you can go get this at comic shops today. Go support your comic shop. Without comic shops, the industry is not going to function. Uh, if you don't know if a shop's near you, we've got a link beneath this. You can put in your zip code. It'll tell you if this link's near you, uh, if the shop's near you. No shop, no problem. We do have some affiliate links. They're affiliate links, so we do get a percentage of that. Want to thank DC Comics for hooking us up with this issue. Uh, always like to be transparent as to what we get for free. And want to thank you, the viewer, for watching. Without you, not really much point. Now, if you're into DC, if you're into comic books, and you're into DC, you know, all these characters, I uh, can check us out every single day at graphicpolicy.com. We're on Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, Tumblr, all at Graphic Policy, keeping it nice and consistent. So until next time, keep reading those comics and keep it geeky. Hey, thanks for watching the previous video from Graphic Policy Television. Just by watching, you help support our site. Thank you so much. Now, if you're watching these videos, you probably care about geeky things like movies, television, comic books, toys, games, video games, you name it. You can go and subscribe right now to our YouTube channel to stay in touch and catch all the new videos, or check out our website at graphicpolicy.com. There's a nice link on this end of the video. But as always, thank you for watching. Keep on rocking and keep it geeky.